with a national news briefing. Investigations are underway after four people have died in a light plane crash in Redcliffe, north of Brisbane, this morning. Authorities have confirmed two on board are from Brisbane, the other two fatalities from Canberra. It's understood the plane experienced engine trouble shortly after takeoff at the Redcliffe Aerodrome. In other news, our country continues to face a widespread COVID spike. New South Wales has broken the national record again for daily infections with 2,566 new cases, most of which are believed to be Omicron. But State Health Minister Brad Hazard is remaining positive as we say goodbye to 2021 and look ahead. We're all hoping for a really good year next year. I think we can still hope for a good year next year. Um, but what we do need to understand is the need to get out and get our booster shots and to still take the basic precautions. Meantime, Queenslanders are being warned COVID isn't only spreading in the metro regions, with reports the virus has spread to Mount Isa in the state's northwest. The Sunshine State recording 42 infections today, 34 of those in the community. Chief Health Officer John Gerard says whether it's locals or tourists, everyone has to tread with caution in high-risk settings such as supermarkets and on public transport. It is likely that most Queenslanders will be potentially exposed to this virus in the coming weeks and, and our behaviour needs to reflect that. We all need to get vaccinated. For the few of us that haven't received our first dose, please, please go off and get that first dose. Scratch off your Christmas gift list with Instant Scratchets. Be an Instant Santa and grab a gift pack in store today. Gamble responsibly. Our Aussies will be looking to add on to their 282 run lead over the Poms as day four of the second Ashes test gets underway in Adelaide. Marcus Harris remains at the crease on 21 while night watchman Michael Nisa is on two. The Aussies going into today at one for 45. Meantime the BBL continues tonight with the Brisbane Heat hosting the Sydney Thunder at the Gabba. And A-League fans can expect a tight tussle between MacArthur FC and the Newcastle Jets. Play gets underway in around an hour's time. Selling the family home. Yellow yeah. on a job. Yeah. Were you first? This is SEFM weather. Checking the Limestone Coast forecast, showers clearing, dropping down to 13 degrees tonight, partly cloudy tomorrow, 22, and cloudy skies for Tuesday. The Listener app is the new home of your local news. Join up to listen live or on demand now.